So uh, we're down in the south of Kyushu, uh, south of uh, Japan today in Kyushu in Iki Island, and we come to show you um, a tomb here. So this is a pretty full-on thing there. We're in the you know, full-on jungly style sort of thing here, with all the huge trees and stuff, and uh, pretty cool, isn't it? So I uh, thought you might like to have a quick look inside if you're up for it. If you like scary things, then uh, probably best not watch it. So uh, there we go, it's getting a bit dark in here. Hopefully the uh, iPhone can give us a bit of light. And uh, there you go, you see the entrance there, it's pretty cool. And uh, there's tons of stuff around in Japan that you just find in the middle of nowhere and you go, wow, it's amazing. And uh, I'm just wondering if there's anything uh, weird and alive in here. I bet there is somewhere. So let's turn this around so you can look at the end there. Oh, blimey. <laughs> it's scared me, just getting to the end. There we go. And that's, I presume that's actual tomb is in. Yeah, obviously being exactly for the taking out exhibit. I can't say the word. And uh, yeah, wow, excavated. That's what I'm looking for. There we go. Pretty amazing, isn't it? And of course, if you're just in here without an iPhone, it's pitch black, except the light from the entrance way there, which is quite cool. So uh, yeah. So there's loads of really cool stuff you can do. In Japan, you just find stuff like this all over the place. We just went into another tomb and another cave and all sorts of things. And like hundreds and hundreds of years old. I'm not sure about this one, some of the ones around there are six and seven centuries. It's a pretty old. Of course, where the uh, Mongol people came and uh, we started invading Japan. Apparently they killed everybody on the island, which is a bit crazy. Uh, and now it's more of a tourist sort of place. And you go for walks and things, but there you go. So. Just thought you might like to see a bit of an Indiana Jones adventure in Japan. <laughs> so I'm Richard from GenkiJapan.net. I'll see you later. Bye.